Hi everyone, this is Kelly from Master Gurus. I'm in our workshop uh, with the lovely Jeremy. Hi Jeremy. He's one of our fabulous technicians. We um, have got a Mazda 3 in the air, which is a Skyactiv G engine, which is our mild hybrid. Um, I just thought we were actually doing another video on jack points, but just thought maybe people don't get to see the underside of their car very often, or a car they're looking to buy. So just wondering if it might mean you're a bit interested in what's underneath. Um, so Jez is going to take us through and see what we can find underneath the car because you all don't get a chance. So I have no idea what's under a car, so Jez is going to explain. But just, all right, let's get you a little, let's get a better shot. So this, we're starting from the front here. I'm going to come under. I do enjoy, this is like... That's what? basically the protective trim for the end of the engine. Is it? Yeah, mo make... most vehicles now have all got protective trims on, makes them more aerodynamic, Is so it? fuel efficient. I didn't even know that was a thing, I just thought it was funny that yeah. it was like car oh. No, they put them all under there. So then we come up to here, so what, because I think this looks like a rocket, <laughs> what is this? This is the catalytic converter, yeah. um, that's what takes all the harmful gases from the engine and makes them nice and clean out the back. Lovely. So if we go back down here for a minute, so we're gonna come back in a minute. So this is just the exhaust? Yeah, the exhaust, exhaust section. Uh, as you can see, everything is all undercover, so it makes it fl air flow better. Because the older cars are not like this, no, are they? No, older so cars, you can see everything. All the pipes. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, it's a bit all. Uh, Maybe yeah, I, all like, that should help protect it, shouldn't it? Yeah, it know? helps protect it from the end. And then you did tell me what this is, what I didn't remember. The, that's the back box rear silencer. So nice. again, that's what makes it nice and quiet. This is not what is on your car, is it? No. <laughs> your car is loud. So we've got like the underside of the car, which I thought was really interesting. But we are trying to give you obviously more information on um, the high. I always think stuff is so interesting from underneath. Um, we're trying to give you stuff about the mild hybrid. So a customer did ask me today, and I think it's a valid point, but Jess, where is the battery, like the lithium battery? The lithium battery, uh, hybrid battery, is located under this trim. So yeah. I'll just grab my gun. Now, I would just like to say that Jez took some bolts out of this earlier because there are quite a few bolts out in the trim, so please don't be concerned that it will come off this easy. <laughs> So this is the battery that stores the energy, isn't it? That, so yes. when you're braking um, and we don't want to waste that energy that is coming um, from the braking and put it back into the car. Very... Mm. Oh, look, so, it's an actual it is there a battery is, there. There's a battery all tucked up under here. Is it that big? Yeah. It's very oh. heavy. Um, God, when that's on huge. <laughs> so, I thought we were just talking about this little bit here. No, no. They're, they uh, are a big, big unit, quite a heavy unit, because we have to take one out on our training for these vehicles. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this is what, basically, when you're braking, accelerating, it all puts energy back into there to use with the vehicle. God, it's interesting. I didn't know it was that big at all. Yeah. So that's where your lithium battery is located. Yeah, and it lies between the. You all start taking the no. covers off and messing with Plus, it lies between the actual chassis rails, uh, so it's protected. So if you do go oh, over okay. anything, it doesn't actually hit that. It tends to hit oh, more of that. Oh, they are clever, aren't they? So, yeah. I love that. So clever. But yeah, so we just thought it's just an interesting little thing that we thought we'd show you while we hang out in the workshop. <laughs> On a Tuesday evening. After hours. Yeah, while it's chucking in the rain. Um, but I just thought it was pretty cool. It's just, like I say, they do look different than modern cars underneath. Um, and like I said in other uh, videos, we are going to try and do some more workshop videos because I think um, you don't always have access to this kind of insight online. Um, and Jeremy and Ben are, and Simon, our technicians, are absolutely awesome. Um, so if you've got any questions, this is where I come. This, this man gives me most of my information, unless I'm speaking to the lovely Trevor and Technical. Um, but yeah, so if you have any questions, anything you'd like to see, anything you'd like us to do, then we can give you a bit more insight. Are you trying to fix something at home and you'd like a bit of advice? We can always help. Um, but our boys are amazing. So um, thanks for watching. Uh, put messages in the box of anything you'd like to see and subscribe to the channel. Okay, bye, Jeff. Bye.